meant to be in the great outdoors forever free you left us last time eating a spot of lunch in Nairn before having a quick look around the shops and checking out this new Seagull recharging point. The following day we set off to search for the local beach. Come on this way! <laughs> He's frightening all the birds off. Hey. He's frightening all the birds off. In order to get there we had to navigate these woods again. He was picking his own route. There we go, put them off at the pass, bro. Don't actually know how long these microphones are going to last either, do we? No. Should have a look. Half past twelve. You just have to excuse my breathing, it's a cross between asthma and hair fever, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. Then follow the green arrows, Blue. Come on. You know, my camera is now covered in dust. Yeah, so so I've just washed the car, I've just washed all the car down, it's covered again. Unbelievable, the <laughs> dust, the, we think it's pollen. It's just everywhere. Constant. We go clean, won't it, Ella? So where do you think this is going to take us then? To a busy road and then across the road and through the woods and is it the sea or is it a lake <laughs> no it's it's the north sea i don't think there's any beach at the the west side of nairn i think all the beach is at the other side it's probably just another woodland walk just gonna get across this busy road first come on shorty Bird song's amazing. The shame about the traffic noise. Mm. At least the sun's shining, it's not raining again. We're not kidding about this road. It's the main road to Inverness, between Inverness and Aberdeen. Right, Blue. It's well busy. So watch the road here, fella. Come close. Come close. Who <laughs> wait. Trees are so straight, aren't they? Oh, tell you what, it's a bit nippy on the old hands. Put some gloves on. Yeah. I thought you should have been in full winter outfit. You'd be more comfortable in snow boots, <laughs> snow trousers, quilted jacket, he's beanie. He's taking the mick, but he ain't wrong. <laughs> he ain't wrong. He ain't. Ain't he? There's a lot of agricultural land up here on the coast, west of Fraserburgh. Totally different from the hills and the locks that we're hoping to see later on in our trip. What do you say you've got there? The boot sale. <laughs> this is just one? Yeah. Is it like in the shoe shop where they leave one out and then you have to ask for the other one? We don't like it. <laughs> Blue doesn't like it.
The surface road soon turned into a track and we guess it's pretty popular with dog walkers because there were quite a few parked vehicles around. Oh, it's just smelly vision. Oh, yeah. Coconut. Yeah. It smells yeah, like a... It smells a... like that, uh, you're drinking, that's how. <laughs> it does like that. Coconut, vanilla, rum. Yeah. Like yeah. I'll tell you something, if I see another bottle of that up there, I'm going to get it because you just can't get it anymore over there. Yeah. Morning. Is it? Oh, afternoon, sorry. <laughs> afternoon. We're off on some hikes, me and they, don't we? <laughs> Aren't we supposed to be sat on a couple of chairs under the sun canopy drinking coffee and eating biscuits? No. They look like sand dunes. It had been a longer than expected walk, but I think we were about to hit the beach. This is the West Beach at Nen. Very similar to the one at St Andrews, to be honest. Nice white sand, plenty of it. And it's playtime. Bernie's gone looking for a ball. Blue always associates beaches with balls and unfortunately he was digging in the rucksack the other night trying to get at it when we were going to bed so I took it out. So now we haven't got a ball. Hello you, where you be? What's Bernie doing Blue? <laughs> Bernie nearly lost his hat.
It was so peaceful here. We really didn't want to leave. This was to be our last beach, because later on today, we were to head inland. No! Uh-oh! Blue's rolls! Oh. <laughs> you might as well let him finish it, I'll give him a brush. Uh-oh! You're covered in sand! It's a bit windy. So we headed further down the beach and it wasn't long before Bernie spotted something in the dunes. Oh, so it is. Oh, uh oh. What are you doing? And then trouble struck again and Blue had another roll. We were soon leaving this last beach behind and walking up by the golf course. What a lovely cute little clubhouse that was. Handy. Now that's something you don't see on campsites. Can't say I've seen one before. And I think these little doggies next door were in for a real treat. Bernie looking for you a treat. Oh, there, look. I know it's not bacon, but it's better than nothing. These are all in very tiny bits. Mm. Oh, I can smell them from here. Tiny, tiny, tiny. I'm just looking at the map. Very tempted walking on the beach this morning to actually go around here and up the other page and up there. But better and hot. I better stick to the plan. The plan was to go down. The, oh, the snow roads through the Cairngorms and so that's what we're going to do so we'll work our way down to Granton on Spey and from there on in who knows because the plan is to work further west so we'll go back via Killing and Stirling and then pick up the back roads to uh, Dumfries and so we can stay off the motorways so Bernie cleaned the car down again and got ready to leave. Now we've not had this external cover very long and it works very well. But even now, weeks later, it's still covered in all that pollen. Just can't seem to get it off. You a bit weary, you a bit tired. What do you think? Hey, you don't like looking at the camera, do you? Hmm? Can we not have a conversation? Not when there's a camera about, eh? I wonder what it is why you don't look at the camera. Eh? As soon as I put this down, you're going to look at me again, aren't you? Yeah. Mm. We're going for a ride today. Eh? We're moving on. Yeah? We don't know where we're going to sleep tonight yet. We'll find somewhere. Somewhere exciting. Yeah. Okay, so that was an interesting stay. We don't usually do campsites. No, do we? we decided to stay an extra night. Yeah. Only well, because it was the weekend. And yeah, I didn't want to travel on a Saturday. We were, we were finding an off grid place, might have been a bit more tricky. <coughs> and they got all that washing done. Yeah. So uh, that's excellent. Bill loved it because uh, he loves the woods. Yeah, good dog walk. Well, I recommend it, it's a nice site. Don't you worry
to a P4 at parking half a mile there and it was just said P. Here we go. Here we go. Mm. Yeah, we'll see which way the wind's blowing. Hopefully it's either the front or the side. There's lots of these little, um, I want to call them lockets. There is a name for the small one. Actually, I think they are still locks, aren't they? They're still locks. I think so. I'll see if I can find it on the map. That's a real shame. We wanted to go and see this castle that's in the middle of a lake, but this road here that we wanted to take, for some reason, is closed. So we can't go. So we, we parked in a lay-by further on, and it's absolutely amazing. There's some snow right up on the top of the mountains over there, but I don't think you'll be able to see it. I'll try and zoom in. Just the remainder of some snow. I'm going to brew up now and have something to eat. Do you think we're going to get this drink before it rains? When we're en route somewhere, we tend to brew up outside. It's easier than moving everything around in the back of the van. Can't beat a cup of Yorkshire tea in an amazing spot like this. Now when we're out we always empty the excess water out of the kettle and pop it down on the ground in the hope that it'll cool down before we're ready to go. We haven't left it behind yet but there's always a first time and what Bernie didn't know is, when we picked up supplies, I picked us up a little treat. Look what I got. These Berghaus mugs that we've had for some time really do keep your tea or coffee really hot. You have to be careful sometimes. Thinking about it later, this would have made a lovely overnight stop. Remembering to pick up the kettle, we got ready and we were soon back on the road. watching this video please hit like and subscribe and join us next time when we finally get to enter the Cairngorms National Park and enjoy a quiet park up alongside the banks of the River Spey and yes it really was that green <laughs>